Hi students, welcome to Math Today. At the beginning of every math lesson, we are going to begin with a warm-up called a number talk. And with these number talks, they're going to help us practice our number sense, um, our subitizing skills, and our adding and subtracting skills. If you have a sheet of paper or a whiteboard, you can work alongside me um, so that you can get practice working on these skills. So every day of the week has a different number talk. And on Mondays, we have Make It Monday. And that is where we're going to have a number where we want to make it. So for example, today's Make It Monday is with the number five. So our, our numbers down here are zero through nine. And we're going to use these numbers to either, we're either going to join two of the numbers together or take away and subtract to create the number five. So let's get started. Let's say I want to start with this number four. I'll put the number four right here. And I want to add a number to four. to equal five, because I want to make five. So four plus what other number equals the number five? One way that I can do this is by using dots to help me um, draw the number. So four is one, two, three, four. I'm sorry that it's not that pretty. I am drawing with my laptop. And so um, it kind of gets messed up sometimes. So I have four dots, one, two, three, four. How many more do I need to get to five? Let's draw one more right here, okay? And now let's count. I have one, two, three, four, five. So now I just made the number five. How many dots did I add to four to get to five? I added one. So that means 4 plus 1 equals 5. I used 4 and 1 to make 5. Now, if you want to go ahead on your paper or whiteboard and think of other ways to make 5, you can. Um, you can pause this video. I'm going to show a few more examples since this is our first Monday talk. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to choose the number 2. Okay, so I have the number two, and I want to add another number. I want to combine two with another number to make five, to equal five. So two plus what number equals five? Again, I can draw my dots. That's just one way that we can show this number. And I'm gonna show two dots right here. One, two. Well, how many more dots do I need to add to get to five? I have one, two, oh, that's our bell, three, four, five. So how many dots did I add to get to five? I have one, two, three, four, five. I have three dots that I added to two to make five. So two plus three is another way that we can make five. I'm going to show you one more way that we can make five. Now, this isn't the only way, but since it's a warm up, we don't want to spend too much time on it. Let's say I choose, let's say I choose the number six. Now, I notice the number six is higher than five. It's greater than five. Here's five and here's six. Well, I'm going to have to subtract to make the number five. And you learned about subtraction last year in kindergarten. And if you don't remember, that's okay. I'm here to help you along with this. So we have the number six. I'm going to have to take away a number to equal five, to make five. So I'm going to draw my six dots, just like I've been doing, one, Two, three, four, five, six. Now, 
Subtract means to take away. So I need to take away one of my dots to equal five. So I'm going to cross out one of my dots. I'm taking away one from six. So now I have one, two, three, four, five left. And that's what I wanted to make. I wanted to make the number five. So what number did I take away from six? I took away one. So six minus one equals five. Now again, these are not the only ways we can make five. There are so many ways that we can make the number five, but these are the only examples that I'm going to do today. If you want to do some more examples on your whiteboard or paper, that would be awesome. And I can't wait to see what you guys have learned. Have a great time in math today.